Belle here and once again we're doing something a little different today. What I kind of set out to do today was to do something. I didn't know what I was going to do and then I decided on doing the Sanderson sisters. And then I realized that Winifred Sanderson doesn't have freaking eyebrows. So instead of doing all of that, the first thing that I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna try to block out my eyebrows. I've never done this before. It should be an interesting trick. Um, and I'm not doing it the way that everybody else does it because I don't have what everybody else has and I don't have time to go out and get what everybody else has. So I do not have Prozade. I do not have a glue stick. I have Elmer's glue. Elmer's glue and Cody Airspun and a brand new spoolie. Actually, this isn't the brand new one. Look at that. Look at all the stuff on it. That's kind of hilarious. You can't really see it, but I here. And a brand new spoolie. Oh, my nose. And I'm gonna just, I'm gonna wing it. I'm gonna try this out and see how this works. And I would love for you to keep on watching to see the debacle of my uh, internet fame. <laughs> as if I have any at all. If you like this video, if you like this kind of content, please hit subscribe and share and like and all the things if you want to. By the way, I will explain our new mascot coming soon, uh, but don't worry about that right now. Moving on. All right, so the first thing that I'm gonna do is put my hair back because I do not want to get any glue in my hair. I guess I'm just gonna have to use this little guy. I really don't like using chongos, ligas, or hair ties like everybody else in the world knows them as because they're not as good for your hair unless they're like really lo like loose and wango like this one excuse me guys i'm still getting over cold <clears throat> but yeah if they're really loose and nice like that that's pretty good but if they're real tight you probably shouldn't use them very long because they'll mess up the ends of your hair even if you don't straighten your hair blow dry it or anything you will get split ends because you use these things so don't use them unless they're nice and stretchy anyways guys moving on I'm a little bit scared right now, but we're gonna do this because I want to know how this works. I want to see if this will work or not. Isn't this like the best part of glue is like this whole situation when it gets stuck and then you gotta like pull little pieces. I, oh my gosh. Whoa. And I dropped things. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to take the cap off actually. I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now because I feel like I need to. You know what's funny is it used to be so easy to do this. Mm-hmm. Because that's how easy it was. You used to just put it in your mouth and all right, this is gross as I thought it would be. God, this is taking a lot longer than I wanted it to, but we're gonna get there. We're gonna get there and I'm gonna have no eyebrows. It's gonna be awesome. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to put the cap back on this. Yeah, there you go. Just put it there. And then I'm gonna put some of this on my hand, just a little bit. Here it goes, just a little bit. And then I'm gonna zhuzh it around. I'm gonna like mix it just so that it can get a little bit more tacky and less wet. Does that make sense? Just a little bit. And then I'm gonna start putting it in on my eyebrows, I guess. This is very scary for me. I just got my eyebrows back and I'm already f with them again. So here we go. In there. And then we use our little spoolie to comb it up and back. And do this kind of gently to where it's not pulling too, too much, but you do want your brows coned back as well as possible. See there. This is really turning out to be not as scary as I thought it would be. And if it isn't, then I'm probably gonna end up doing this a whole bunch this holiday, just because. All right, that's not too bad. I mean, I really did think it was gonna be a lot more scary than this. Oh, excuse me, but it's not. And it's funny because I really didn't think this was gonna work. I thought this was gonna be like a total mess up. Hopefully I don't lose my eyebrows in this process. That would be absolutely horrible. I'm just letting the brush do its thing. I'm just pressing it and moving in an arc and it'll do it. There it is. Okay, let's do another layer real quick. Probably gonna scare the crap out of my boyfriend in a little while because he doesn't know I'm doing this. Oh my god, my stupid thing turned off. I keep forgetting to put on music. Music is a life. Okay, so this is probably not a good idea for a long-term thing, like a long-wearing situation, because it seems to like pull off very easily. Mm -hmm. I don't know if this is gonna work. I'm starting to get a little bit of like things falling down and stuff like that, so I don't know, man, but we'll see. I'm just, this is an experiment. This is an experiment. I'm sure like a ton of drag queens have like experimented with this already and been like, bitch, this don't work. Well, we're gonna find out for ourselves because we're that type of person. I'm the type of person that I have to try something by myself 
and fail at it in order to believe that it won't work. I feel like there's probably a lot of people in the world like that, that just don't say that they're like that. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> but if it doesn't work, then at least it was funny. All right, I'm gonna try to put the Cody on. Everybody should have this, by the way. Everybody should have a thing of Cody Airspun. It's cheap and it works like awesomeness. So let's just try this and see what happens. Whoa. Enough powder for you? I think that's enough powder. Jeez. I'm gonna get my beauty blender because that's what I've got. I don't have a puff. And then you just pounce this into the face. And some of my hairs are still popping out. We'll take care of that. So then we just let that sit for a bit. I don't know what it is about this stuff, man. This stuff is like intense. It absorbs everything. Like it's real crazy. I'm starting to get a look at what I would look like without eyebrows and it looks really, really weird, but it's probably just weird because I'm not used to it. Okay, so I can successfully say that this does not do the job as well as, uh, what do you call it? What do you call those things? Glue stick. So I'm pretty sure it doesn't do as good as a glue stick already because there's a lot of like marking and weirdness happening. But we can see if concealer will cover that later. This is like my favorite song right now. I'm actually gonna share this with you because I have to. It's real funny, I just got into Nicki Minaj. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with myself sometimes because she's just so cool. Okay, let's get a little bit more on here. So this looks pretty crazy. So I'm gonna try to put the powder over again and then I'll wait for it to dry. I'm pretty sure this isn't gonna work actually. Like it seems like it's working. Oh, I'm making a mess with powder, of course. My socks fell down. All right, so this is what we got so far. This is two layers of glue, right? And two thick layers of Cody Airspun. And I have a hole right there. <laughs> but you know, these kinds of things happen when you're experimenting. It still feels pretty wet. I kind of want to bust out my hair dryer and just like blow on it. I think I'm gonna do that. Let me go get my hair dryer. Oh, it feels so crazy. You can't even open your eyes when you do this. It's nuts. It's so much air. I have it on one, guys. It's like a whole lot of wind hitting me in the face. It feels so weird. I almost feel like I can't breathe. It's so scary. Ooh. Why am I moving my head back and forth instead of my hand? I feel like my eyes can't open. That looks pretty good and it feels pretty dry. So I'm gonna do one more layer. It needs to be a little bit more even. I can still see my hairs like there and I don't wanna be able to see them. See, but this is always the best part of glue on your, on your skin is that you can just do like this. Ah, it's pulling, ooh, ow, oh, that's so great. I got powder all over me. It was like the funniest part of this. Right on the eyebrow. Right on the eyebrow. All right, it's on. Not too bad. And it's crazy because every time you put more glue on it, the Cody gets like, it just soaks it all up and becomes a whole nother like medium. It's really weird. Look how much powder there is in here. Like this is stupid. I mean, look at it. Look at it. That's a lot of powder. Oh my gosh. Come on, buddy. That was nice and hot. fluffy again. You can't even see it. It flashes back so bad. Okay. Let's just put this on real quick. I'm really pressing this last one. Really press it. And it looks a little bit more even now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So it's pretty much done. I just need to wipe off all this excess, but I'll do that in a second. Yeah. Look at it. It's all over my arms. Like it's all over everything. I don't even care. Like this is so cool and funny. Like I love that. 
I've never tried this before and I can't believe I've never tried this before. I'm such an insane person. Like why the heck have I never done this before? So now I'm gonna try to hold this further away because it's crazy. Ugh. Whoa. I broke something. Oh my god. My record fell off of this. I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna die. I don't want to. Okay. Aw, my record fell off of the wall. <sighs> Son of a pickle. Okay, I'm sure it's fine. Back to this whole business. Let's... I saw a spark for a second. Okay. On warm, it feels a lot better, but it felt real crazy on cold. I think it was because it was cold that it was. It, I had such an aversion to it. No, it feels pretty good. Okay. Oh god, this feels so weird. How do people like stay in this all night? Like that's insane. Oh my gosh, it's lifting. My eyebrow already popped. Damn it. Well, I guess that's kind of what happens when you use this instead of what you're supposed to use. I'm just gonna stick it down a little bit and see what happens. It's gonna look real crazy now because it's gonna be an actual unibrow. But you know what? That's this is the first time we have our moment to make our mistakes right now. This is how we do this. This is how you learn, honey. There's no better way to learn than to make mistakes. So make them and have fun doing it. Like me. Okay. That could be okay. I'm gonna go ahead and put some more, a little bit of air. I'm gonna do the cool air this time. It'll try to stay further away. You know, the cool air like sucks the sucks the air out of me. It's so scary. Oh my god, that seems about right. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and try to close this Cody Air Spun without making a huge mess. I'm gonna make a mess. There's no way around that at this point. I mean, it is what it is. This is hilarious. I'm not gonna lie. This is really funny to me. It's funny to me. Oh, ah! It's funny because usually when I tap on that thing, ah, geez, as many times as I did, I don't get anything out of it. Like, nothing nothing comes out and that's why I did what I did and now it's nuts like it's everywhere it's good enough I got it all over my legs thank god I'm not wearing pants <laughs> I'm just kidding guys I'm wearing shorts uh, I got glue on my leg my leg my leg anybody remember that guy from Spongebob he was like the cutest I'm gonna go ahead now and I'm gonna try to put some concealer over this actually I need to get all this glue off of my hand first just, oh god it's gonna hurt I I, I uh, okay. okay, so that's kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of cool. It seems to be basically what we're trying to go for and we'll see what happens once I put some concealer and stuff on. I'm gonna use one that's not as expensive as Shape Tape because, you know, I'm a broke ass bitch. Uh, what is this? This is Alme Clear Complexion in light medium. So it's kind of gonna be closer to my actual skin tone. I'm just gonna go in. And then I'll go on with a beauty blender in a second. This is really thick. That's what she said. Okay. I'm gonna go get this wet real quick. I always forget. Oh my god, I almost fell on my butt. Now I'm gonna just pounce this around. Damn, I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty good. That's pretty good coverage. Now I'm gonna get my actual foundation. Go over with that. I always forget to shake my foundation. Oh my god, I look so weird without eyebrows. Actually, I don't, I mean, I really don't mind it. I feel like I kind of look like my grandma when she had cancer. Apparently my grandma used to like to do tutorials too. I actually have a picture of her giving a tutorial, which is really hilarious. Like, who knew? I had to get it from somewhere, right? And there it is, pretty much, guys. I mean, it, it worked. It wasn't the best execution. Of course, because this is the first time I've ever done this. And obviously we could have done better, but I mean, it's functional. <laughs> All right. Me thinks it's functional. It's a little bit ugly. I mean, if you look at it up close, it looks pretty crappy, I guess. But I mean, it's kind of, it is what it is, right? I mean, it's not, it's not too bad. I'm surprised. Actually, I'm gonna try to put some primer on real quick. And I mean, oh God, oh, oh my gosh. This is literally how much I use. This is the Dewy Lumino Face Primer Photo Focus by Wet n Wild. I like it a lot. It's very, very cool. Gives you a lot of shine and stuff. It's tinted, which I normally wouldn't go for, but recently I've kind of liked it, so I've been using it. Okay, so we're just gonna go with this. And you know what? Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do a full face with this, just my face. And then I guess we'll do another video shortly today because we can. And I've been wanting to do it for a while, so I guess it's time.
all that jazz. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna throw a little bit more of this. Where, where did it go? Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Here we go. This looks insane. It looks nuts, but I kinda like it. Not that it's gonna become my go-to thing or anything, I'm just saying I like it. It's popping real bad right here. So we're just gonna pretend that that's not happening, okay? I'm excusing myself from being perfect because this is my first time. I'm giving it my all to see where this goes. This looks insane. I kinda like it. So that's one bit done. I know I'm popping, I know. Next time this won't happen. Next time we know more things. Let's add contour before we do the final, final touch. crazy that looks looks nuts and like it I kind of want to go wake up my boyfriend right now without telling him I did this because I feel like it would be really really fun guess is this is what we got and this is where we're at did this work yeah it kind of did but at the same time I think that my execution it needs to be improved let me go ahead and take my hair down so it doesn't look so crazy it still looks crazy I look like what's her name I look like Charlize Theron in monster which is kind of insane like I said I know that this could have been executed better but for my first time I think I did pretty good I really like the way that the contour looks on this if you guys want a full like tutorial on how to contour and highlight your face properly or at least my way let me know in the comments and I'll try to teach you guys because it's really not that difficult like I it took me forever to figure it out but it's really not that hard especially if you use your own features to do it like it, it's a lot easier to work with it when you're doing it on yourself I like this I think it's interesting I think it's fun and I'm gonna go ahead and go now I'm not gonna take it off just wait till the next video and you'll see what we did with this Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for hanging out with me and being with me today, spending your time with me, all the things. But don't forget to check me out on all my other social media accounts, my especially my Twitch, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, hanging out, playing all kinds of things for the Hayo Bell Horror Hour now that it is October and we're having a lot of fun. So yeah, also Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, all the things. And yeah, I really enjoyed making this video and I hope you enjoyed watching it. So yeah. Um, if you want to subscribe, please do so now. Become a member of the Monster Fam and get your sparkle monsters on. And yeah, I'm still working on this. It's really funny. I'm still working on like the actual fam because I'm kind of combining everything that I love and becoming one big thing. So we're working on a mascot and it's all a thing, you know, whatever. But it's going to be really cool eventually when it comes to fruition. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out with me. And I'll see you guys later. Okay, bye!